Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Clarence. I'm with Behavioral Health. And I'm here to speak to you about uh, stress relief. And I'm going to share with you a little bit about spirituality, the mind and the body. Our spirituality is so, poor, so important in our lives, which brings balance back into our lives. Three things that we have to nurture all the time. That's and, and very important in our lives. It's our minds, our bodies, and our spiritualities. The spirituality is the component that supports the mind and the body and brings balance back into our lives. Very important what we put into our minds. Very important what we put into our bodies. And it's very important that our spirituality is nurtured to balance these things out. And so, our bodies are very sacred. And so, and there's many ways that we can do this to find balance in our lives. Sp through spirituality, we do prayer life, we do meditation, we do, we find a, a place where it's quiet, maybe even reading a book maybe even just doing a walk, things of that nature. And so that's why it's so important. Spirituality, spirituality has to be fed. That's the spirituality that brings balance back into our lives. And so, uh, so we all have connections to that. You just, each of us has to find our own to find balance back into our life. Once we nurture the mind, the body, and the spirit, the spirit will keep us mentally and physically balanced like this. My name is Sarah Becker and I'm the Native Connections Grant Coordinator for the Kickapoo Tribal Health Center. Today I am here with Candy Hurley who is going to give us some tips and tricks for some quick yoga options to help us stretch, take care of ourselves while we are working or if we have some time to be outside. Hi, I'm Candy Hurley and I'm with the SYTI Grant and I just wanted to show you a couple of things you can do while you're at your desk. Um, it's important to maybe stretch every hour and to give your eyes some time to be away from the screen. So let's get started. Um, we're gonna start with uh, just a stretch for your neck. So you're just gonna drop your ear to your shoulder. Um, so you wanna make sure you're not bringing your shoulder up, you're just dropping your ear down. And you should feel a little bit of stretch right here in your neck. And then you'll do both sides. And then you can do a little twist so you can place your Left hand, this is my left hand on my right knee, and I'm just going to turn and look behind me. Wave at the cars. <laughs> it feels really good on my back. Um, another thing you can do is just scoot up in your chair, and I like to call this a figure four because it looks like a four, and you're just going to put your foot on top of your knee. And you can stay here if that feels good, or you can lean forward. I can feel that I'm really tight. And you can do that on both sides. And then another one, you can just uh, have your legs a little bit wider. And then if you want to touch the ground, you can reach over, stretch your back, and touch the ground. Also, uh, a couple things you can do is just breathe. So you can close your eyes and take in four breaths into your nose very slowly, and then five breaths out of your nose very slowly. And that's all we have for today, and hopefully I'll be back with some more tips. Thank you.